This is FYI on your TV brought to you by Hometown News. I'm Kathy Botham. I have got Colleen Luby back with me here on FYI. Thanks for joining us. <laughs> Thanks for having me. You are with the Second Smith Falls Scouting. What is your position there? Other than a mom, it's very important. Well, <laughs> yes, actually, I hold a couple of positions. Right now, I'm the contact scouter for the Beaver Group, which is ages 5 to 7, as well as the contact scouter for the Cub Group, which is ages uh, 8 to 10. Um, so that's, I'm one of the scouters that run program each week for each of the two different age groups. Excellent, excellent. Now you've got an event coming up, but it's also in support of a, a, a big event, your World, your World Jamboree. Let's talk about what the Scouting World Jamboree is. Excellent. So the World Jamboree is an event that happens every four years somewhere in the world. The last one was in um, 2019, and it was in West Virginia, the United States. And it's an opportunity for uh, scouting youth to attend an event in a world level. So it's a it's a, a camp that's I believe it's two weeks long, and they get to um, experience scouting at a, a with people from all over the world. And uh, you know to have that experience, you know you, you know yourself, you've been involved in the scouting uh, for for years. And uh, to be able to join people from all over the world and how they, you know, do scouting, it's, it's a learning experience, I'm sure. Oh, it's, it's super exciting. I've never done it myself. Um, my husband, Neil, who you've spoken to in the past, ha went to the World Jamboree in West Virginia. And he came back so energized about um, all of the things that he experienced. And, uh, and his, his whole take on the scouting movement shifted as a result of that event. It was amazing. And you know, you, you know, when you go to these events and you say you get inspired and you learn things and everything like that, but when you're networking, I'm sure people walk away from talking to you and Neil, you know, inspired as well too. And they're going to take that back to, to their scouts. I hope so. Yes, yes, for sure. For sure. Now, where is it going to be held this time? It's in South Korea. Um, don't ask me to pronounce the name of the location, but it is actually really cool because the location is what they're calling reclaimed land. So they've built a camp for the scouts in South Korea that we are going to get to use. And what they've done is they've reclaimed land from the ocean to build this camp. It's really quite amazing. Wow. And how many people usually show up to these? Oh, I knew you were going to ask me that. It, it's, um, it's hundreds, thousands sort of thing. Thousands, yeah. thousands, thousands. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wonderful. Now, you, you have an event going on at uh, Westminster Presbyterian Church coming up. Let's talk about that. Sure. So on May the 7th, we're hosting a mom-to-mom -mom sale. Um, and the table, people can rent a table. And the table price is going to support sending uh, youth and scouting members from Smith Falls to the World Jamboree. Excellent, excellent. So yeah, people can get a table for twenty dollars each, I believe. Tables are twenty dollars each, and there are still tables available. Um, and uh, we we hope that people come. Our intention is to have people bring a variety of uh, baby, kid, or teen items and clothing, so that there's a good selection, and that um, we can raise some money for our program as well as people can. Um, can help clean out their closets and, and maybe put a little bit of uh, extra money in their pockets as well. So you, you, you yourself have done a little bit of cleaning. You've got some stuff you want to, to sell. It's, mm -hmm. it's, it's like having an indoor yard sale. You've got a roof over your head. <laughs> yep. Lots of people that's are going to be showing up. You know, that's exactly the way to think about it. And it's everything there will be geared to children or teens, babies, right. kids, and teens. Now you're taking donations as well. So would those donations just go towards your jamboree? Yes. So we're, this year we're just taking we're taking monetary donations. We don't have the facilities um, or the help at the moment. That being our first sale, we're not taking donations of items, although we have had people ask about that. Uh, but we are definitely taking monetary donations. And we're hoping that if it's successful, that we will do another of these sales before the trip. And potentially we may look at taking up um, item donations at that time but not this time. All right, I mean, you know, we're all spring cleaning right now and uh, you've mm -hmm. got lots of stuff you wanna make, uh, have a table to go to, but you know as well, you can go and you can buy some things too. We all know, we've, yep. had, we've all had children that you know you buy something brand new two months ago and it doesn't fit now. 
So it doesn't take long to grow out of something, but to, to have a, an event like this to go and find some more clothes and more toys and that sort of thing, uh, yep. it, helping people out. So, Yep. And in fact, I encourage you that it, to come and check us out, even if you don't have children of your own, because you might see something of interest that uh, for someone that you know. And in fact, um, I wanted to put a little push out there. Our daughter, Mara, who's one of the um, youth that are planning on going on this trip, has putting, is putting in a table of artwork that um, it's all geared to um, art that could be put in a child's room, but, you know, it might catch somebody else's eye as well. Excellent, excellent. You've got some talented children, you do. <laughs> I think so. Yes, for sure. So the date again, it's on May 7th from 8 till 1. How do people get more information or, or be able to get a table from you? Right. So um, we have an email. Um, it's uh, mom to mom at secondsmithfalls.ca. We also are on Facebook on the Scouting, um, the Smith Falls Scouting Facebook page. And uh, more information comes to me, and I'm happy to put that out. Um, I can share that information with you as well, if you like. Excellent. And, and if people want to become uh, involved in beavers or scouting, that sort of thing, how do they get a hold of you for that? To get a hold of us for that as well, you can reach us on the, uh, on the Facebook page, um, the Second Smith Falls Scouting, or you can send us an email at scouting at thestrider.com. And uh, my husband, Neil, or myself will get back to you. And we take both boys and girls from ages 5 all the way to 17. We have programming. And you're back in, in being able to meet together again? Yes. Yep. We're both meeting in person and outside. Um, so we are running, getting into the spring. You know, today is not a great day for it. But um, getting into, into getting outside and doing all kinds of activities. But we do also meet at Westminster Presbyterian Church, which is where the sale is going to be held on the 7th. Excellent, excellent. Well, I thank you very much for taking time out of your day today, Colleen, to talk to us about your mom-to-mom -mom sale on May 7th. Thank you for joining us, Colleen Luby from the Second Smith Falls Scouting. Thank you. Thank you.